Welcome everyone to RVT Rashid's video tube, where it's Rashid all the time. Anyway, Rashid's very busy these days with staff and partners, but not to worry, enjoy this pre-recorded ride cast on RVT Rashid's video tube. Sanki korku trenindeyim. Makes Hostess Cupcake such fun? First, you like the fudgy icing you up. Then you eat up all the devil food cake. And so much you got left over is a gushy, squishy, creamy middle that you can squash with your tongue. Mm. Hostess Cupcakes, Fruit Pies, and Twinkies Cakes. Fresh snacks for the snack in the middle. Nigger bitch off the plane! Sir, please you stop. You need to stop. There are children. Please stop. Nigger! Stop! Hey, that's not necessary. Oh, what's in my ass? Oh, what the fuck are you doing in my asshole? What's in my ass? Uh, uh, what the fuck are you doing in my ass? What are you doing? Speak up, I can't hear you. Oh yeah, you smell that funk, don't you? That's what smell you that one. You wanted to steal my funk? Hold on, folks! When a VCR from Pepsi and Acme. Register at the Pepsi display of your local Acme. One VCR prize at each store. Looking good together, looking good, looking good. Looking good together, looking good, looking good. Good things to share, good friends are there. Looking good together, you and CBS, you're looking good. The one you love on CBS, the laughter and the sighs. There's comedy and drama and stars get in your eyes. Day or night, all lives are right when CBS is there. There's just no better looking and it's all right to stare. Looking good together, looking good, looking good. Looking good together, looking good, looking good. Gather round, there's gonna be new people to meet. And good friends from good years gone by. Funny people, scary people, the bitter and the sweet For the best in sports and news reports, sit up and say hi Mystery, comedy, singing and dancing Movies and specials, the thrill of romancing Looking good together, looking good, looking good
guys, the sun's already up. It's gonna be a golden day. Let's see. Oh, those golden Grahams. Oh, those golden Grahams. Crispy, crunchy Graham cereal family breakfast treat. Oh, those golden Grahams. Oh, those golden Grahams. Golden honey, just a touch with Grahams. Golden wheat. It's a great tasting part of a complete breakfast for the whole family. Try those golden Grahams and have a golden day. Coffee with my dick lip. Alright, coffee make my dick lip. <laughs> um, hot chocolate, soup, tea. No, this is the gift. Yeah, this is the season for that, guys. Hey, baby, come on, man. <laughs> Get yourself ready for a trip to McDonald's land.
love? Monsters. I'm Gorgonzola, one of the new monster vitamins. We come in a haunted house, seven of us. I'm Screaming Mimi. I'm Squeaky. I'm the blob. We're delicious. Mom, we think children should get vitamins by eating right. But when they don't, <laughs> monsters can help. New monster vitamins and monster vitamins with iron. Look for the haunted house in your favorite store. the greatest invention since the napkin. Franco-American, uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. Push it, click it, press it, flick it, tune it in, turn it on. This is what you watch it on. Any way you work it, integrate your circuit at the city. Circuit City. Come to the place you're welcome. Technology with a heart. Welcome to Circuit City. Services state of the art. I got you down a gizmo for electric machismo. Some amplitude for the radical dude. We're tuned into your attitude. Come to the place and welcome technology with a heart. Welcome to Circuit City, where services state of the art. Welcome to Circuit City, where services state of the art. have to make the gravy to enjoy meaty tasting gravy train you can serve it dry or mixed with water to make gravy it's meaty tasting and completely nutritious either way mmm this gravy train is delicious crunchy dry it's delicious with its gravy too Gaines gravy train dog food tastes good with gravy tastes good with see that or oh, yeah Bumbo Club! Surf at Big Sur, pounding the rocks into the shape of dreams. The random energy of a Big Apple Saturday night. Iowa farmers harvesting the land near the smell of homemade bread. And when you're thirsty, the taste of an ice-cold Coca-Cola. If you stop and think for just a moment, you'll find we've got more of the good things in this country than anywhere else in the world. Have a Coke and start looking up. Look up, America, see what we've got. See that? Oh, yeah. Mumbo Club! person nobody can resist and that's a baby so love made baby soft with the innocent scent of a cuddly clean baby that grew up very sexy and foaming bath body lotion body powder and body mist so innocent it may well be the sexiest fragrance around loves baby soft because innocence is sexier than you think for your baby at christmas see that see that oh yeah Mambo Club! Well, hello Larry. hello Larry You talk to people all day for a living But all those easy answers you are giving Are you really living your life that way? Portland is a long way from L.A. A long way Cause you are giving don't always 
This is the season for that. And it's also the season for giving. Just like the record saying. This is the season for giving. I don't know how many people are uh, signed in to give, but we don't. And that's the end of that discussion. Uh, on your screen right there is the advertisement for Donation. Y'all don't understand what Donation is. Stick with me. It's the show is like a block, like uh, uh, one Saturday morning. But Donation is uh, specializing on female attire, uh, animation, things like that. We have Linda Lace. We have a lot of things coming up you guys can be interested in. I'm working on Bala Nest. Yeah, we're working on Bala Nest. And, Bala, and, and that's very really fun. And we're going to be viewing some of... Uh, I'm going to show you guys something about Bala Nest. Okay? We're going to be talking about that. What it's about. What it, you know, what's going on with what y'all seeing on screen. Because... When I finish this, when I finish this, we have to move on with other things now. And that means uh, getting these shows pumped out and all. But the main thing that's taking, um, this holding up, is getting, um, yeah, exactly, it's getting Dalmatian together. I mean, it is so fucking hard to get Dalmatian together. It's taking forever, but uh, what y'all see on the screen is progress. So, uh, you know, we, yeah, we get credit for that. We get credit for that. And uh, you guys can really like it. Okay? So without further ado, I'm going to take you out. Now, what I did, I created something for my for our carophilia around here. Carphilia. Hard for me to say. I created all of this shit. And I can't even keep up with I created, um, like, an intro. Well, anyway, y'all check it out here. So y'all so, so be seeing this before y'all see the car carphilia right here. And, um... Yeah, it's like an advertisement, like congratulating, because RBT has that, and, uh, and and we, yeah, and I did this, we did this, and it's cool, ain't that cool? Yeah, I did that, and 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 and, 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 and it gives it more um flavor, it gives a more like direction, it gives a more, it, it, you know, a a, a, a computer pet, a computer pet, whoever well, heard of it. The pet boy. You see what first around here, already see my TV video too. And hopefully they'll work in it. And you guys, when they do their shit, y'all can get their computer pet if they ever make one. I don't know. If they ever make a computer pet screen saver, I don't know. But they should, because it's really fun to have. Taking it serious, dude. It's really fun. It really feels like a pet, yeah. But you know what? They had this thing in the 70s called a pet rock. And people say it really, really, dude, you should try this shit. <laughs> this shit is just fucking crazy. It really feels like you have a pet. So, yeah, I'm excited about it. I just came up with it, man. I just came up with this idea and everything. But anyway, uh, talk about domination. What y'all were seeing with the, um, the ballerina. We're going to talk about ballerina. It's kind of hard to, um, well, how the fuck do I begin to talk about this? I got plans for Dalmatian. Dalmatian is your average block. It's not your average block. Like, I know it's like one Saturday morning, like a trilogy. Like, it's just, it's just, it's just a variety show. It's a variety. Uh, what do you call one, one, one Saturday morning, two, one, two Saturday morning? You call it a, like a variety block or something. Dot Nation is like dinner on RBT. That's all I could call it. I don't know what else to, I don't know what else to fucking, what, what else would we call it? But like a, a block or something like that. You know? But like, you know, we try to figure out what to do with it. Like we can you know, and we get everything in order. But one thing's for sure, it's taking forever. You know, anything worth anything is worth it. You gotta really, you gotta, um, take your time and, yeah, anything worth doing is worth doing right. You know, and so it, 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 slow is better, and that's what we're doing. Now, before we get started in this, uh, and don't worry, I got, and I got, and I'll tell you something else too. Y'all like that computer shit. I mean, that, that video game. Like that. They like that video game. So since we know y'all like that, we don't do another one. The next picture up probably is I don't know. Because I want to get this donation started on 
don't know what it is and, and, and what it's about and stuff. You know? So y'all won't be left off because I know y'all marveling at it and don't know nothing up really. You know, because it, 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 yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's not launched. Yeah, it's not launched yet. It's not launched yet on RPT. It's still being built. So it's not really launched yet. But when y'all see it, y'all gonna know. Y'all gonna know. So, um, I want to show you this picture, okay, of, it's a brand new picture of Bala Ness. Now, what Bala Ness is, actually, I, 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 I got this, we got this idea from Disney with this fucking, uh, fan team shit. I don't know if y'all just watch that, sit through that shit, but a lot of people can't. <laughs> A lot of people can't sit through no Fantasia. I can sit through any Disney movie, but Fantasia is one I can't sit through. I want, we want to be like that. I want it to be like Fantasia. There's no talking in it. It's just these ballerinas that's going through a whole, going through a, a tremendous. Put it up. Let me show you the new picture. Then we'll talk about it. Put the new picture up. Oh, check this out. Check this out. I'll let you digest it for a few minutes until I stop talking about what it is, okay? Let's check this out. Get branded at the American Pants Company's brand name sale. Get branded with acid wash jeans in fantastic new colors. Jordash, Bill Blast, Sergio, Calvin Klein, Alessio, and Ginger from $29.99. Get branded at the American Pants Company with Zodiac sweatshirts, $10.99. Sets, $24.99. Caps, $3.99. On sale now at the American Pants Company, Frankfurt, 69th Street, and Roxborough. And our new store at 12th and Passio. Jelly, Vaseline Petroleum Jelly. It's a wonder jelly. As a lip shiner, never refiner. In a first aid kit, it conditions the mitt. It's a wonder jelly. Like a dry skin cream, a foot softening dream. Takes out squeaks, waterproofs little cheeks. It's a wonder jelly. As a makeup remover, a jack hand soother. It's 100% pure. Vaseline Petroleum Jelly. The Wonder Jelly. Let it work wonders for you. Mom says, Sally, I'm choosing about peanut butter. She chose you. Oh, I'm picky about peanut butter. That's why I pick Peter Pan. It just plain tastes better. Peter Pan is the rich, peanutty taste kids like Sally love. In a survey, kids with a preference preferred Peter Pan's taste over Jif or Skippy. Mom may buy it, but I eat it. Peter Pan, I pick you. Particular people pick Peter Pan peanut butter. Do you scramble eggs like this? You never get a perfectly blended egg, and then there's the cleanup. But now there's the egg scrambler. It scrambles an egg while it's still in the shell. The egg scrambler perfectly blends the egg white and yolk in only five seconds. Scrambled eggs, French toast, and omelets not only look better, but taste better. If your kids don't like the looks of runny egg whites, get the egg scrambler by Ronco, a great Christmas gift for only $7.77. Walgreens, Woolworth, Wilco, Osco Service Merchandise, Riverdy, Montgomery Ward.
girl. Ain't nobody out there, but... I'm not being in the Star Wars movie, so I'm not going out there. We're not going out. We, not, we don't feel like being in the Star Wars movie, so we're not going to fuck up. I don't want to get no blue milk and all that fuck. That's all the fuck it is. Out in the fucking streets is a bar. It's a Star Wars bar fucking shit. And I'm not, I don't want to get no Star Wars bar shit out there. I had to do my food. We had to do our food shop out there. Baby, you, you said it. I, I mean, yeah, yeah. Y'all been out there? It looks really fucking. Let me play some music, guys. But anyway, let's get that. See what y'all see on the screen. That sound. <laughs> That's so fucking. Um, this is really some. Uh, let me see something. Let me turn on some music, man. I am hooked. Yeah, we are hooked on this violent mess. Because I believe that this style of animation, this style, I say animation shit. Well, it is that, well, well we don't, I'm saying this style of performing, this violent range thing here. If you had a daughter, would you let her partake in that? Would you let her do that? That ballerina stuff? I just think, in my opinion, in our opinion around here, we think that it can be something. No, that shit, it can really be something because it's so... Especially with little girls. Little girls just fit it, dude. Women fit it and men fit it off. Y'all know that. But when you get to them... See, this is why I like it. Little girls. This is why I like women. Because in Hollywood, they have nothing. Every movie, they cry in. You can't, you barely can pick. If you pick three movies randomly, you're going to find a woman crying in it. And I just think, mm, I want to, I want, I want to see them do something else but cry. You know, I ain't not wrong with a woman crying, but every movie, dude, you gotta have a woman crying in it. Every fucking one, dude. So, I don't know. I just wanna, do, I wanna, I wanna do something different that with, with them. I don't, I used to like, uh, uh, child movies as a child. I went to the movies a lot as a child. My dad took me to the movies a lot as a child and everything and all of this shit. And, um, you know, it's never the kind of movie I want to see. Yeah, it's never, it never was kind of the movie that we, that, that we can stick out, sink our teeth in. It's never that kind of movie, you know? So, what if I could create the movie we want to see? You know? And that's, and that's what this is. I want to see... Like, I was so fed. Like, Disney tried to steal. And I'm going to say it like that. Because everybody say Disney stole uh, Steamboat Willie anyway. Yeah, we don't say that. Of course we don't say that. But that's what people say. He stole it. Steamboat Willie. And, uh, you know, he started out with a little girl. In his animation. What did he? Because he knew that with them, you can create things. You know, you can really create things with them. You can't do so. The little boy, which I was, of course. I mean, everything, I did every. I had imagination like crazy as a child. I was with imagination like crazy as a child. I was. And why do I want to... Yeah, why do we want to do that? Why do we want to go and, uh, and, f and do he, the little boy had everything. He had all the aliens. He was friends with all the aliens. 
It's not with a female doing so with a person like myself who likes to create things and make up stories and all. I can't do much with a little boy because he's done everything. And if I, yeah, that's the thing. And if I do come up with something for him, it's like, you won't get fascinated. You won't be fascinated. You won't be fascinated because you're used to him having everything. You're used to him having every damn thing. So, you're not going to be um, fascinated. You're not going to be like, Oh yeah, I gotta, I gotta, uh, you know, watch this movie. You know, it's a, okay, another little boy with another fucking adventure. You know, what is he gonna have? A flying dog? Or he gonna have a robot friend? He had every goddamn thing under the goddamn sun. What he gonna have? He, he, what, what is he gonna have? What is he gonna have? What is he gonna have? That's so, you know, out, outrageous that he ain't had a fuck already. So. I'm not having it on RBT. I'm not gonna have it. I'm not gonna. I want to start new. I can create with them because they got a fresh can of canvas. If you really look at little girls, they have a fresh canvas. You can really experiment with them, make them. I mean, you can really make them have a tremendous adventures and everything. But you gotta have the imagination to do that. You know, you gotta have. The imagination to, to allow that to flourish through. And with them, they're fresh, so I can do that with them. You know, with the women and stuff. Because women don't have anything, so. And y'all see Linda Lace and all, but I don't want to go too far with, um, with certain th aspects of that because people might get the wrong idea and shit like that. And, Women might get offended. I'm strip yeah, that's why I'm sticking to Sardisian women. You know, getting my ideas and everything. So the real, you know, you may say these women act strange around here. Unlike on the, like, The Simpsons or some old shit like that. It's because these Sardisian based. So they act different. You know, they act different. We're cult, we're spiritual, we're around here. And everything is spiritual. So that's, that's, all, that's what they get around here. That. So that's why they act that way and stuff like that. But so getting back to the issue. Oh, this is what y'all see on screen. I created all of it. This is my imagination, y'all. I just want a, a Disney Fantasia with with ballerinas. Yeah, with ballerinas. With ballerinas. That's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want to get. I want to create it. protection at your fingertips. Skinny stickless, fat with flavor. Skinny skinny, that's the shape of skinny stickless, fat with flavor. See how skinny, taste how fat. Only one gum gives you nine slim sticklets instead of seven wide ones in a regular pack. New sticklets in natural spearmint or peppermint. Skinny stickless, fat with flavor. Quality meat, deliver to your door, chef's choice, 
the freezer pleaser. Great service for years now. It's old-fashioned butcher shop service. But right over the phone. We save time. And money. Phone ordering, quick delivery, it's very convenient. Fresh, top quality meats every time. They're great. Open an account right now and get an additional 50-piece steak and shrimp supply free. Call 1-800-772-BEEF.
If you're angry, 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 stop your feet. If you're angry, 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 stop your feet. My mother uses my shampoo. My daughter uses my shampoo. Johnson's, Johnson's baby, baby shampoo. shampoo. Johnson's cleans gently. No more tears. So it can't hurt my hair. And unlike some other baby shampoos, it can't harm my eyes. Johnson's gives my Julie's hair that clean, healthy look. Johnson's leaves my mom's hair so shiny. And I, I want, want my, my hair to look just, just like hers. Johnson's baby shampoo from Johnson & Johnson. For a healthy looking clean, you never outgrow. Win a VCR from Pepsi and Acme. Register at the Pepsi display of your local Acme. One VCR prize at each store. Why are you closed? Tell us why you're closed. Tell us why you're closed. Why, why, why are you closed? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Today's story, starring me, and not starring Nanette Memoir. <laughs> what the fuck is the problem? A fucking road rage or something? No, Clearly you about to fucking hit my car and I got kids in the back, bitch. Back. Right, so learn how to fucking drive. So why are you getting out of your car? Because I'm about to slap the shit out of you. Oh, my motherfucking mama, bitch. You will learn today, you fucking cracker. I'm gonna fuck who you with, bitch.
So, um, I just figured I could do something different. I could do something different. I want some kind of, we don't have anything around here like this. And we also, yes, I'm saying, we also have, um, we have something else like this, like Alice in Wonderland. Uh, I forgot uh, what it's called, uh, I, f I forgot. It's an RVT photo, yeah. Yeah. So y'all digest that picture right there and get used to it <coughs> because this is where we at for a while back. I'm trying to find the fuck out. Maybe I'm smoking weed. Maybe we just smoke No, we ain't smoking weed. We helping us. Balanest is going to be, Balanest is a masterpiece, rather than you know it or not. It's a masterpiece. It ain't even done yet, you know? It may not be everybody's forte. It may not be everybody's, whatever that fucking word is. Everybody use your forte, forte, whatever the fuck it is, whatever that word is. Whatever that word is, it's not everybody's that word. But... It's it's what it's gonna be watching. It's gonna be watching. So And nobody cares. Nobody cares. Nobody cares. As for the way we scream and shout, one by one, I'm not the other. Can't move me, move me, move me, cut. I ain't seen, I ain't seen that. Rocking on to the break of dawn. I make cold money every time it's on. I can't be Walt Disney, but he's one of the uh, people I look up to, you know? 
I look up to him. I look up to him because he he accomplished something. Even though they trying to take, they trying to tear it down. They trying to tear down Disney because Disney own everything. It's Disney Disney is a threat. You know, it's a threat. It's a it's a threat. Everybody scared of it. It gobbles everything the fuck up. I make old money every time it's on. Dominal garage. Tal, tal, tal. Mia, mia, mia. Okay. Выросла я в замечательном месте, о нем я пишу свою лучшую песню. Ох, ох, ох. Золотистые поля и хэх, эх. Бескрайние моря, Кубань. Житница России, Кубань, жемчужина России. Искренне верю и вас заверю, если есть на свете рай, то это... Краснодарский край – это рай. Краснодарский край – это щедрый урожай. Краснодарский край – роскошные курорты. Объятия для тебя всегда распростерты. По дороге на море куплю я арбузы на пляжу, поем кукурузу. Затем на красное солнышко погляжу и еще раз искренне скажу. Если есть на свете рай, то это Краснодарский край. All the fat boys did, all the beat, all all the fat boys did, all the beastie boys are dead. <laughs> I mean, really, where's the respect? I mean, where's the fucking respect, man? So anyway, what y'all looking at on the screen is a fantasy animation that's coming to RBTC, and I'm talking. And I'm, uh, yeah, we're plugging it all around here. <laughs> we're plugging the shit out of it all around here. Everybody was looking at that domination of it, you know, and it was half done. It wasn't finished.
It wasn't finished. We're going to get it started at the same time, but I have some other shit too. My woman, let me find something on this fucking computer, man. Wait one second here. Let me see, man. Hold on for me. Howard is girly, and girly takes up where baby Jane leaves off. <laughs> Everyone's dying to meet girly, rated R. I'm looking for something, guys. Just give me a second here. We over the house chilling out. And I'm trying to tell you about my Rashid content. And at the same time, we're trying to listen to music. Where's the, where's the fucking thing? Where's... Wait a second. 
רבנו. I got some tree. I'm looking at some shit here. See, we want to get this up because we didn't still didn't put we didn't still put that scooter up. Oh, mm, 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 mm. We'll find it. Let me see. Try in it. Try in it. Whatever you want, girl, you know I can provide whatever you need. Oh, baby, you so sweet. You so sweet. I can provide whatever you need. Get branded at the American Pants Company's brand name sale. Get branded with acid wash jeans in fantastic new colors. Jordash, Bill Blast, Sergio, Calvin Klein, Alessio, and Ginger from $29.99. Get branded at the American Pants Company with Zodiac sweatshirts, $10.99. Sets, $24.99. Caps, $3.99. On sale now at the American Pants Company, Frankfurt, 69th Street, and Roxborough. And our new store at 12th and Passio. has a better way, the Visa Check Card. And if your ATM card has a Visa logo on it, you've got one. It automatically deducts from your checking account everywhere Visa's accepted. You're despicable. Visa Check Card works just like a check, only better. What a maroon. It's over. Oh uh, yeah, try. Yeah. So yeah, try it. In, okay, try it. In. Cause I can't find it over here. Let me see. And what keeps hanging on? Where is she? I don't know where that's at. <laughs> I swear to God, I swear, I'm not, I'm not scratching my balls here. I, I don't know where the fuck this is at. Check inside the tube. 
It should be. It, let me see. <laughs> you fuck with my head. Let me see. My grandma already did that, and you making it worse. I can't buy it, but I know it's, um, let me think for a second, it, I know, I know, I know. I don't know where the fuck this is, I don't know. But you know what? <laughs> If it's like that, well, I know what it, I know what it's. At. I think I know what it's. At. I don't know what it's. At. But I'm not going to show it because I believe that it's a reason for. Yeah, it's right in there. I know what's in there. I know what it is. Just as sure as I got a juicy dick. <laughs> That's how I know. Don't question me. What the fuck you questioning me? What the fuck I just... Jesus, man. What the fuck? <laughs> that was a good one, man. <laughs> I, I think I, um... Well... This is what I, this is what we was talking about, guys. What do y'all think about this? Now let's bring it to the audience. Yeah, let's get these. Let's get my Rashid B's. Now y'all know y'all my Rashid B's. Y'all know we friends. Y'all know we go down around here. Y'all know that. So what do you think about a show like talking about all Rashid content? They, my baby said, well, you know, you guys are so sensitive. Shit, you know. <laughs> After about the third Rashi show, all your price just run away or some shit like that. Oh, that's too much. That's too much. <laughs> I ain't even fucking doing nothing, dude. Stop playing with my fucking nipples, dude. Y'all even like my art or don't y'all like my art, you know? Ain't nothing to be scared of. Why, why you playing with my nipples, man? Give me a fucking break. No, we trying to do something around here, you know, like, you know, build something, do something. And we ain't trying to sit around, you know, playing titly wings. I don't even know what the fuck a titly wings is. What do you play your titty? I got man tits. Do you play, that's how you play it? I don't know. <laughs> I do got man tits. <laughs> Oh my god. What do you mean you got man tits? <laughs> I got man tits. I got we got I got man tits. They got big they got they got big bazooka. Big Hey Rashi What are you talking about? Hey Rashi, what are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, Rocky, what are you talking about? I got man tits. Tits. If you got tits, I got tits. Hey, Rocky, I got tits too, but nobody seen them. Me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. So, I'm, I, what this is what I wanted. Wait a minute, wait a minute. What is that anyway? What is that? That right there is Balaness, man. Balaness. Balaness? Yeah. Balaness. Oh. Okay, you satisfied? Yeah, I'm satisfied now. Okay. Alright. Well, thanks for stopping in. Anytime. Give me a call. We're going to lunch. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, that's good. It's a thought. We're going to lunch. It's a thought. It's a thought. We're going to lunch. Have a nice time. Okay, it's a thought. It's a thought. 
I'll, 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 I'll plug you. I'll, 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 yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm a nice guy too, Rachi. Don't forget about me. He he he. Yeah, I ain't gonna forget about you, yo. You're nice too. You're nice too. <laughs> You're nice too. That sounds like some kind of fucking science fiction movie. You're nice too. I want to do Rashi content, you know, like Cyber Rod and stuff like that. That'd be fucking cool, man. Do some Cyber Rod. And some original Rashi content that nobody ever heard of before because we need stuff to look at around here, you know? Whether you know it or not. We need shit to look at around here. What would life be without we ain't, we ain't fucking looking at nothing, you know? So I came up with, you know, so y'all remember Cyber Ride. And if you ain't see that, if you didn't see that, it's on uh, RBT. Just look it up in a, in a video section, right? Yeah. Take a look it up in a video section. It's right there waiting for you. You look at it and enjoy. <laughs> if anybody watching this at all on, on YouTube, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It's a hot wiring me. It's hot, well, hot wiring us, string, you know, pin, uh, uh, linking us together, and because they don't want to give us views. That's so childish, man. <laughs> Fuck. Oh my God. I don't mind. We don't mind giving nobody a view. We don't mind, man. No, we don't, you know, Baba. I mean, but that's the way people are. You, you gotta accept people for who they are, you know? I say nothing wrong with them, nothing. But if that's the way they think, you know, you know, so be it. Just because we don't, they don't mean they get, they got a fucking. They're different. These people are different. They like balls. But most of them like balls. The belts and things. They sports. They like sports. They, they like balls. So you gotta respect. No, I ain't talking about nobody. No, I'm just saying. Most people like balls. Y'all guys like balls, right? Belts and sports and stuff. Okay, so we gotta respect that around here, you know? It takes all kinds to make up the world, man. Don't never fucking forget that. It takes all fucking kinds. And that's what the Bible says. That's what it got. Somewhere in there, it's somewhere in there. Probably, probably in the middle part. Probably the Book of Psalms, because that's beautiful, right? Probably the Book of Psalms is there. I know it's say somewhere. In there. Yeah, it takes all kinds, of all kinds, you know. So, uh, the deal is, what's the deal? Let's hear some. Let's hear some. Um, let's hear. Some. Yeah, give me that right there. Let's go disco. Let's go 1970s. Dude. So, I this is going to be a lot of work. I know this shit is going to be a lot of work. There's no way this is not going to be a lot of work. But it's going to be work well done. It is. Y'all got some food because this, yeah, this is what I'm saying. This is the worst month for winter time. This is the worst, February is the worst fucking month, dude. So, expect a lot of shit. But y'all see what's going on? Y'all see what's happening with the what? And they, and it's like, um, they busy with the primary elections and they talking right over this. It's this movie called, what's it called? That movie is called, um, I forgot, I forgot, but it's just, they just going about things like the book, like the Bible say. They they take no note. They take it no note, and it's funny as hell, dude. It's funny as hell. They, I mean, all of this weather shit going on, and these men sitting around here still trying to debate. They only, they not paying it no attention, and it just looks so, it looks like a movie or something. Like, two things going on at once. Shit, <laughs> it's so fucking funny, man. They're not taking no fucking notes. 
of what the weather is doing. It's just totally destroying everything. Things people never seen before here. And these motherfuckers still just just going on and <laughs> right over it. It's funny. It's funny. It's just it's funny, man. It's funny as fuck. They, I mean, just like the Bible, they paying it no attention. To, <laughs> no fucking attention. Really crazy, man. Really crazy. Yeah, but the Bible says one day they will pay attention. And ask the rocks to fall on top of them. And ask the rocks to fall on top of them, man. So, you know, one day they will. Not jinx or nothing or nothing. But, in fact, right, if that's what the Bible says, that's what the Bible says. You know, it's not changing, you know, it's not like that. It's just that if that's what the book say, that's what the book say, so <laughs> who wants to change this shit? You know, and people are speculating that you can't take out from the Bible and add to the Bible. Well the truth of the matter is you can add to the Bible and you can take things away from the Bible. That's why God said anybody who doesn't that's your ass. So it's anybody that the end of the Bible say anybody who adds words or take words from this book got the plagues that's in this book going to whip your ass. In other words, it's going to whip you. So it's a threat. It's a warning. So if nobody could take your air from the Bible, that wouldn't be there. <laughs> in fact, the Bible would be some kind of freakish thing on the planet Earth. It'll be like you try to add. It'll, it'll be like try to add something to the Bible. Watch what happens. It'll be a phenomenon. It will be a phenomenon. Man will say, that book you can't add on to, it will be in the United States government, dude. I swear, the Bible is real. You cannot add a word to that book. And you can't take a word away from the book. And right now, it will be like the Smithsonian or some kind of UK museum. as a book with real power, dude, because you can't add... No, 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 no. You can add to it and you can take it away. But here's the thing. Here's the thing. God's spirit is there. So whatever you do is not going to do shit. <laughs> I swear to God, I'm not lying to y'all, man. This is true. That warning would not be there if you couldn't add or take words from the book. It wouldn't be there. It would just be obvious. You would see it. Yeah. So, for all this work, I thought y'all know about that. That you can't add and take away from the Bible, but it's going to come out the same. It's going to come out the same as the way God wanted to come out. It is. It is. The biggest um, questions. No, well, I'm not even. I'm not even. I was great to go somewhere, but I was. I'll have a. Um, yeah, yeah. I'll have a. Uh, a a lecture. Yeah, I'll have a lecture, and we'll talk about it. We'll talk about it here. Because this ain't the place to fucking, uh, you know, talk about shit. This ain't the place for this shit, man. This ain't the place for it. Not, on, not right here on this picture up right here. I mean, the, I mean, we in disco. We listen to disco music. For sure. We listen to disco music, so. <laughs> this ain't the place for it, you know. Those who add any words or take any words from this book is going to see the curses in it. That's a warning. You know, you can do it. You still can do it. If there was no way for somebody to enter into a house, would you put on the house nobody is supposed to enter private property, nobody's supposed to enter it? Think about it. If you know for a fact it was a visible force that keeps people away, would you put up a sign for the people to not enter this house? <laughs> see how stupid it is? So you can do that to the Bible. You can. Yeah, you can. But you're going to get your ass what when you do. And, and it's still going to come out the way God wanted it to come out. It doesn't matter what you put in the Bible. It's going to still, the message of God's kingdom is still going to be ushered out when somebody reads it. It doesn't matter what you put in. Yeah, that's a fact. That's a fact. But people people believe what they want. And, you know, that's not where the power is. 
taking from the Bible and putting stuff in the Bible. That's not where the power is, by the way. That's not where the power is. The power is when you do what that Bible say do and you see it's real. That's the power. Not the other shit. Not the other stuff. But this ain't the show for that talk of religious stuff. You know. Is that some weed? Yeah, pass me some. Thank you, sweetie. I didn't know. I didn't know you was bringing me some weed. Yeah, give me that some weed. Hold on for a second, guys. While I smoke this shit. Hold on for a minute. So you know, I can still talk to y'all, but if I start coughing, please forgive me. But anyway. Yeah, so, um, it's just a fucking trip, man. You know, like, all the speculation about the Bible and everything, it's just, it's just, you know. And with the Pope, did he still, oh yeah, by the way, the Pope's still trash and shit. Now he's saying it's a disgust, it's a disgrace to adopt a child. For, for you to adopt a child from... Like, if a woman carry, like, have, raise a baby and you want to adopt that baby, it, you know, the woman can't do it. The man can't do it. So, they friend. They got a friend to do it for them all, all of that. That's adopting the child. He, he said it's disgusting. It's deplorable. But it's okay for, to bless homosexuals and their activity. So, you can see that um, he's, he's on a, he's on, yeah, he's on something. He's going on with something. I don't know how far he's going to go. I don't know. But I know it's part of Armageddon. It's, 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 the, it's the beast destroying the heart. It's, that's all it is. Because uh, he's destroying religion. He's destroying it, man. He's, he, I mean, people that in religion are confused as hell. But the world see the Pope as being cool. Right, right. The world see him as being cool. So, you yeah. know, I, I mean, I don't know how you're going to win that shit. I mean, like, but for the religious world, it's, um, it's devastating. And I don't know how they're going to win it. I don't know. I don't know what they're going to do. I don't know how they're going to win that. Because the Pope just destroyed it in the religion. If you're not in the truth, you know, the Pope is the one everybody watch. In the Watchtower magazine, in the Wake magazine, they had the Pope in there. Keep your eyes on him. So when we was, when Clinton was here, he was a, Okay, guy, you you know, you, and then keep your eyes on the Pope. Keep your eyes on the Pope. Back then, if, if Francis was the Pope, we'd be losing our fucking mind, dude. It's time for Armageddon. Because when the Pope do it, that's when it's going, yeah, that's the, because he's the leader of the fucking thing. So, God, man, it's actually happening, man. And a lot of people don't believe it. A lot of people don't believe it. But this ain't the show for that, man. This ain't the show for that. This is, um, Rashid content. Rashid content. There's a fragrance that's here today, and they call it Jolly. A different fragrance that thinks your way, yeah, they call it Jolly. Kinda young, kinda now, Charlie. Kinda free, kinda wow, Charlie. Kinda fragrance that's gonna stay, and it's here now, Charlie. Ba -do -ba -do. The Color Dynasty 2, 1250, with any $5 Revlon fragrance purchase at May Company.
Okay, Eunice Travel Plans. I need to be in New York on Monday, LA on Tuesday, New York on Wednesday, LA on Thursday, New York on Friday. Got it? Got it. Got it. So you want to work here? What really makes you think you deserve a job here? Well, sir, I think on my feet I'm good at figures and I have a sharp mind. Excellent. Can you start on Monday? Yes, sir, absolutely, without hesitation. Congratulations, welcome aboard. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. And in conclusion, Jim, Bill, Bob, Call, Fred, Low, Dork, Adolf, and Ted. Business is business, and as we all know, in order to get something done, you gotta do something. In order to do something, we gotta get to work, so let's get to work. Thank you for taking the meeting. Petey did a bang-up job. I'm putting you in charge of Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh, perfect. I know it's perfect, Peter. That's why I picked Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh's perfect. Peter, may I call you Pete? Call me Pete. Pete. There's a Mr. Schnittler here to see you. Call him to wait 15 seconds. Can you wait 15 seconds? I'll wait 15 seconds. Congratulations on your deal in Denver, Dave. I'm putting you down to deal with Dallas. Don, is it a deal? Do we have a deal? It's a deal. I gotta go. I got a call coming in. Hi, Doc. Just dealt with Don. In this fast moving, high pressure, get it done yesterday world. Aren't you glad there's one company that can keep up with it all? You got a deal, good. I'm putting you down to deal with Dick. Dick, what's the deal with the deal? Are we dealing? We're dealing. Dave, it's a deal with Don, Dork, and Dick. Dork, it's a deal with Dave, Dick, and Dave. Don, it's a Dork with Dick, Dave, and Dick. Gotta go, Dave. Disconnecting. Gotta go, Dick. Disconnecting. Gotta go, Dan. Disconnecting. Federal Express. When it absolutely, positively has to be there overnight. Push it, click it, press it, flick it, tune it in, turn it on, this is what you watch it on, any way you work it, integrate your circuit at the city, Circuit City. Come to the place you're welcome, technology with a heart, welcome to Circuit City, where service is state of the art. I got you down a gizmo, for electric machismo, some amplitude, for the radical dude, we're tuned into your attitude. Come to the place you're welcome, technology with a heart. Welcome to Circuit City, where service is state-of-the-art. Welcome to Circuit City, where service is state-of-the-art. Mom says, Sally, I'm curious about peanut butter. She tells you. Oh, I'm picky about peanut butter. That's why I pick Peter Pan. It just plain tastes better. Peter Pan is the rich, peanutty taste kids like Sally love. In a survey, kids with a preference preferred Peter Pan's taste over Jif or Skippy. Mom may buy it, but I eat it. Peter Pan, I pick you. Particular people pick Peter Pan peanut butter. Well, hello, Larry. Hello, Larry. You toast you it's the Wonder Jelly, Vaseline Petroleum Jelly. It's the Wonder Jelly. As a lip shiner, never refiner. In a first aid kit, it conditions the mitt. It's a Wonder Jelly. Like a dry skin cream, a foot softening dream. Takes out squeaks, waterproofs little cheeks. It's a Wonder Jelly. As a makeup remover, a jack hand soother. It's 100% pure. Vaseline Petroleum Jelly. The Wonder Jelly. Let it work wonders for you. Y'all gonna see a lot of um, picture ups, guys. I'm gonna tell you now. You're gonna see a lot of picture ups. You're gonna see a lot of Linda Lee. And you're gonna see a lot of Dalmatian. Because I gotta get this started. You know, I got Rashi Cybertube. That's okay. Yeah. Rashi Cybertube is okay. Army, well. I gotta get um, Dial Nation started, man. So y'all gonna see a lot of stuff from what you're looking at on that screen right there. You're gonna see a lot of it, man. And I'm gonna share it with you guys, you know. Because I need I need to get this started, this Dial Nation started. It's been too fucking long for me, you know. And bottom that, that's what y'all looking at on that screen right there. So y'all put, you know, together, put it together. And you see it. You actually see it. You see that we're we're on or something, you know, we're on or something. I told y'all to excuse me while I smoke some weed and here I am smoking and talking to you at the same time. I don't even oh, God. So it's not for kids, guys. It's not for kids. Now, what fascinated me when I was a child, and baby, I'm going to share this with these people, is that movie Phantasm. When I was a child, when I was a child, that movie Phantasm scared the living shit out of me. It really fucking did. Because I've never seen a child get tortured, get tortured. The way that little boy got tortured in the movie Phantasm. But he's dead. Yeah, he died. Sadly. He, sorry. Um, it's sad that, that that guy died. That little boy in Phantasm who was running from that. Who was running from that swift army. 
silver thing. Yeah, he died. And that's that's a, that's too bad. You know, that's too bad. But um I've never seen it before. I've never seen a child get tortured like that before. So scary. But also with the fear, it had it, it had my interest, you know, it had my interest. Like, what is that? What is it? So I like like okay, it's a child a child is in a movie, but it's for adults. That's fucking fascinating. And like, for instance, you take, um, Tightrope with Clint Eastwood. Now, you know that's not for children, but yet he got kids in it. Now, these kids in it are in a movie. They gotta watch the movie, dude. You know, why? When the movie's finished, they gotta sit there and watch it and see themselves. I mean, so they gonna see what the movie is about anyway. They in it, but the point is, it's still not for kids. You know, that's what kind of child I was. I was like, we, we, baby, you know, we grew up like that. You know, I was around the serious stuff as a child. And I played with children too. Don't get me wrong, but I always brought the adult shit over there in, in the children's shit. Because that's all I knew as a child. That's all I knew. I was passed around and every fucking thing. And you know, this kind of bullshit. You know, my mother, you know, that kind of molesting thing, all that fucking thing. And I and I and I don't regret shit. Can't stand her, but it ain't got nothing to do with what she did. It got something to do with what kind of person she is. Yeah. Just make clear for that. It ain't got nothing to do with what she I don't care about that other shit, man. I just don't. I don't know. I just don't. I like it. If it, if, it, if, if I like it, I like it. I like it. So I don't care about it. But it's just the way she's a mean. She she want all of us to, to hate each other. And I left everybody. I ain't got time for this shit. Yeah, and I'm not even gonna get into it on the air. This stupid family bullshit. I, mean, I ain't even gonna get that family affair bullshit the fuck out of my damn face. I ain't getting serious on here. But I don't like. I don't give a fuck about that shit. Don't get that out of here. The only bad news any fucking way. God's God against it anyway. He said, if your family don't like me, then you don't like your family. That's in the Bible, dude, so I don't give a fuck. I don't care. I'm an artist. I talk court. Get over it. I'm not like you guys. We not like you guys. We talk court. And, and, and you may be sounding like me talking like we got sense. You can see me just start talking some fucked up ass shit. Don't think I don't know that. I'm from the street. I'm not a fucking idiot. It's just I like to do it. If I like to do it, then I like to do it. But don't think I'm a goddamn idiot. Because you only know that. Because of, because of RVT. <laughs> so, that, um, yeah. That, that, and that. You know. I wish Soupy Cells was alive, but he did. He was my favorite motherfucker when I was little. Soupy Cells was one of my favorite motherfuckers, dude. He was my favorite motherfucker. And what and what do Soupy Cells got to do with any fucking thing? Huh. People be acting crazy as shit, you know? But what, well, here's the thing. This baloness has never been done before. You never thought about taking those ballerina girls and putting them through, and put them in a world of, I won't necessarily say survival. Because, you know, Fantasia, Phantasm and everything. Not surviving like that, but surviving like that. You know, like, over building challenges and stuff like that. And, and have music behind it in some art symphony. Like some kind of magnificent symphony. That it, the movie just goes on and on and Right. Right. I mean, it, it's really, it really, it really gets you excited to want to see something 
The animation isn't all that good. But you understand the animation. It's blue score animation, Rashid Blue Score animation and right, it's gonna we know it's gonna improve guys. It's just like this for now. It's like this for now. I'm doing it all with one fucking finger. What do you want from me? You know, I'm not using my whole hand. I'm just using my finger. And I'm doing all this animation shit y'all see on the screen. One fucking finger. I need one of those pads where you can draw. Then then I really kick ass. But I don't have this. So I'm using my finger. So, I use my finger. You nasty bitch. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, you yeah. You gonna pull that shit on the air? What the hell is it? No, listen. I use my finger for... Forget about it. Just, I fucking do artwork on it. Just forget about it. Y'all women so damn nasty, man. Y'all, what the fuck is wrong with y'all bitches, man? Dishes, dishes, dishes. A robot's work is never done. Try new Electrosol Gel Packs. It's a new advanced gel detergent that gets dishes sparkling clean. Each one is programmed to deep clean the dishes for you, then disappear. Talk about sparkling. They'll think I had a tune-up. New Electrosol Gel Packs. Dishwashing made for the 21st century. Rosie's missing. Look for her in specially marked packages of Electrosol. Find the Rosie magnet and win a Samsung home theater. Better hurry before someone else finds her. Gives you nine slim sticklets instead of seven wide ones in a regular pack. New sticklets in natural spearmint or peppermint. Skinny sticklets, fat with flavor. See how skinny, taste how fat. Win a VCR from Pepsi and Acme. Register at the Pepsi display of your local Acme. One VCR prize at each store. Are you hungry? Hungry as a gremlin? Here's gremlin cereal. Gremlins, gremlins, bite after bite. What a tasty way to satisfy a gremlin appetite. Gremlins is a deliciously sweet, crunchy cereal that satisfies the hungry little gremlin. That's in all of us. Gremlins, gremlins, bite after bite. What a tasty way to satisfy a gremlin appetite. Gremlin cereal is part of this complete breakfast. Gremlin, yum yum. We've got it. Summer savings at Sam Goody. Pick up Theater of Pain from Motley Crue. Invasion of Your Privacy, new from Rat and shaken and stirred by Robert Plant. On sale now, only $6.99 each. Store-wide summer savings at Sam Goody. Goody, Goody, Sam, Goody got it. Goody, Goody, Sam Goody got it. Sam Goody, got it. Sam Goody, got it. See that? See that? Oh, yeah. Mumbo That's some crazy shit. Anyway, I forgot what I was saying. I know my dick better not get hard on the air. I know that. You know how quick I get hard now. You know how quick I get hard. I don't give a fuck. I don't care if people know about it. I don't care. You know, I, I ain't ashamed of my sexuality. I'm a man. I'm a man. I'm comfortable in my sexuality. I can be sensitive and still come off being a man. I don't care. If you don't know I got a dick, then you shouldn't be listening to me. So I was going to come up in a conversation. I do have a penis, you know. Jesus Christ. So, um, yeah, getting back to this, man. This worm. That's the enemy of the movie. That worm right there. That's the enemy of the movie. That's the enemy of the movie. And along with the fight, along with the obstacles they gotta go through, they gotta avoid that fucking worm right there. That fucking uh, 
You don't know what it is. It could be anything, but I know it's wormish. Yeah, I'll just say it's wormish. I'll say it's wormish. And they gotta avoid that fucking thing. They go through all these obstacles and and challenges and stuff like that. And with color and like Fantasia, like Walt Disney Fantasia, his Rashid's version of fucking like. <laughs> and it's going to be nice. And little girls are so important, whether you know it or not. They're important. Little girls are important. And that right thing that y'all look at is going to be a doorway to some, because they don't have anything I can create with them. I don't gotta say, you know, this, that, the other. I can actually use them because they, they they're not really used in Hollywood. They not really so I can create with them, and it, it's exciting. It's really exciting to deal with them. Uh, to be like getting that, like their thoughts on like what they like to see, you know, like um. You know, it was the, it's this group of girls on social media we came across. And check this shit out. These bitches were saying that the world is too male dominated. And they were and they picked on now check this shit out. They picked on the cereal dude. The cereal. And said, Why is no girl cereal? All of the mascots. Right. For the cereal. Right, our men, our boys. And we had them, so they started with that. And I'm not going to say any name. But I, so we talked about them before when we first came on social media. And uh, they was talking about how it's unfair and, it's, you know, and the shit. They're not really for the women's lib fucking thing. I'm not saying it for the women's lib thing. But they, yeah, they do hold a whole argument. They have good arguments. So I start thinking, you know, why and why is it like, you know, what if they did have something? What would it look like? Yeah, what will, what, what would it look like? What would it look like? It's only one way to find out, right? Think about it. It's only one way to find out. All right. You gotta have the writing skills and imagination and to make this come to life. You know, it takes a good writer to do something with this shit here. And I wanna take on the challenge. I wanna take on the challenge. What's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> I want to take on that challenge. I, I mean, the hardest thing is making up being adventurous. I'm talking ballerinas and some kind of crazy shit. It's it's gonna be RBT's art. Movie. It's the only movie we have that's like art, like showing my art talent that nobody's seen before with ballerinas. Do. I mean, I know I can do this, you know. Make it and right, right off the bat, you look, look at it and say, the answer is no, I wouldn't want to see that. Well, I'm just guessing. I'm just guessing. I'm not saying that, that like, that's the way. I'm just guessing, like. So I say, okay, I don't want to see it. But I'm going to make it so people like that say, this was good, this is good. Well, that I was surprised to see it. Yeah, I, want, I want that right there with this movie. Because I know what people think about it. I already know. I already know. So we gonna, I'm going to work it the fuck out. I'm going to work it out. We're going to work it out. I'm going to make this shit work. I'm 
I'm going to make it work, man. I'm going to make it work. I swear to God, I mean, I'm just so amped up about it, you know? I am. I swear, man. I'm on some crazy art shit, man. I swear to God, I'm on some crazy art shit. Ain't really ain't well, they back from vacation. But the weather the only thing is that it's this this battling for, to be president of the United States. Because it's February. Already it's February, so it's time for another president of the United States. And I wonder who is it gonna be? They have a closing argument. And I wonder who is it going to be. And next month, guys, is when we're going to have our new president of the United States. Next month. Just keep your hands up on things. Wake up. Hello. Is anybody home? Hello. Is anybody home? Next month, we're going to see if we got a new president or not. We only got any that long off. And so we're going to see who get, who's going to be our next president. But what I want to say is don't be surprised if Donald Trump get that because he's leading. He, not only is he leading, but any spiritual people out there, this is Armageddon. It's the worst thing ever. So don't be surprised, dude. Right now, some people are saying it might not happen. It might not happen. It might. We know it's not going to happen. We hope it's not going to happen. But we, it might, too. It might. That this is Armageddon. It's supposed to be the worst this and the, hey, dude, that's the worst thing. <laughs> and then think about this. We see also that if he if he's not president, then whoever is president is gonna be worse. They gotta be worse than him. If this is the Great Tribulation starting, if this is Armageddon starting, they gotta be worse than him. Think about it. Think about it. So in other words, if he don't be president, and somebody else be president. They gotta be worse than if he was president, and people gonna wish he was president. <laughs> you know, it's just it's it's really confusing. You gotta be on a certain level to understand what I'm talking about here. So, it's crazy, man. Shit. I'm sorry, I dropped. That's my fault. That's my fault. That's my fault. That's the motherfucker fault. 
It's my fault I dropped, I dropped the clipboard. It's my motherfucker, dude. Okay? It's my motherfucker. I dropped the clipboard. It's my motherfucker, dude. It's my fault. My motherfucker, dude. My fault. Well, I couldn't, you know. Everything's so fucking good. We got, we need, we need space, dude. We need fucking space. I can't take this. Yeah. I guess so. I guess so. If we can find it. This movie's gonna work, man. I got some good shit. What time is it? What time is it? Well, that's too bad. We ain't finished talking yet. Shit. We ain't finished talking. Yet. I know. We're gonna just do another one. We're gonna just do another because I can't have. I can't keep y'all here, man, because there's too much going on in the world today, and that will give RVT a bad, yeah, it will make RVT look bad, if I keep y'all here away from everything, because, you know, I'm not going to do that, and it will make RVT look bad, and I ain't trying to hear, and I ain't trying, we ain't trying to go through that fucking shit, we ain't trying to go through the shit, so, all we're going to do is, um, Sing the Disney fucking thing. It's just time to say goodbye and shit. Shit like that. It's, you know. Today is Tuesday. You know, I don't fucking know. I, I wish y'all be good. We stick around. But I don't want to keep y'all from, you know. They saying, look at me, look at me, look at me. You know, that's what they say. Look at me, look at me. So I don't, and, and on top of that, yeah, the Almighty saying, no, look at me. You see, so that's a battle, right? So it's interesting to see how this turns out. Everybody sit back and relax and enjoy the show. And we're going to see how it, yeah, everybody sit back and relax and enjoy the show. Because the nature of God, of the Almighty said, look at me. And they said, look at me. So we're going to see what happens, you know. And by the time we talk again, there will be some shit probably we can talk. Yeah, there'll some shit be, be jumping off. And, but they ain't going to stay like this, you know. It's not going to stay, you know. It's not gonna do it. It's not gonna stay like this. <sighs> not gonna stay like this. I love some women, dude. I, but I, I don't. I don't really. I'm not really digging the women today in 2024, dude. But I love some fucking. It's kind of hard to say now, you know. It's just they just different. I, I can't fuck. I can't fuck it. I can't do it. But I still love some women, dude. I do. I don't. If I can find, you know, the ones that I come across. Got my sardines in the way, so. Oh, well. I do You can make things for you can You can create more women. You can create things, you know. You can, they don't have a fucking thing but that Cinderella bullshit. And the princesses. You get, you know, all these different princesses fucking shit. And, man, do something else. Make them go on adventures. Do something with them fucking. Um, 
And and the ballerinas are the most classiest ones when it comes to like when I say classiest ones, I mean like ain't gonna be like ain't gonna be no Girl Scouts or any fucking thing like that. That's what I'm talking about. What's classy about the Girl Scouts? But this is this is fucking classy. This ballerina. I want something like you could do something with them. You know? I ain't talking about that man on butterfly bullshit either. I mean, I ain't talking about that. That's, how many times they gonna try to do that fucking thing? That man, on, yeah, I mean, tell me, man on butterfly, the nutcracker sweet. It's the same shit. All I mean, they ain't got shit. They ain't got nothing. Create something else, and shit, you know? Make a suspense on something that you know have the audience like, oh wow, look at this. You know, you forget about the ballerina shit. Then in the movie, they come up with some crazy. Uh, pillowette or some shit. I mean, oh, they ballerinas. You know, have fun. You know, you can have fun, dude. You can have a lot of fun. Fun. A lot of fun. You ain't gotta be a damn, you know, too much gorilla ain't good for you, dude. You know? Too much gorilla ain't good for you. It's not. I know, yeah, it's been a while. Not much, how about you? Then you're in the holiday, hell, or this is when we was wanting to talk to you. Now you're in the room. Your week is over for a while. It has been a long, long time, and I really do miss your smile. I'm not talking about the linen, and I don't want to change your mind. And you've been rolling rolls when it's going around, and I really want to see you. We can go walk in and make the park. I'll we'll take a walk around the beach. I'll stay at home and watch TV. You see, it really just don't matter much to me. I'm not talking about the men, and I don't want to change your mind. And there's a rolling road where the stars are round, and I really want to see it. I won't tell you promises No, you don't have to lie Then we do the same before You say I love you and say goodbye I'm not talking about the land And I don't want to change your mind It is a global goal and it starts around And I really want to see the real I'm not talking about the land And I don't want to change your mind But it's a rolling roll and it starts around And I really want to see it I really want to see it in. I'm not talking about the land And I don't want to change your mind all right, guys, let me get out of here. Take care. I'll talk to you guys soon. Stick by because I'm going to have another picture up soon, okay? Stay safe. Mind your business. And stay out of trouble. Bye-bye.